In this in Trentino is about to interview Professor Partha Dasgupta from the University of Cambridge. Professor Dasgupta is here in Trento to give a keynote lecture at the Faculty of Economics where he will present the Inclusive Wealth Report 2012. The assets that should be included in the Inclusive Wealth Index comprise reduced capital, roads, buildings, machinery and equipment, human capital, skills, health, education, the kind of capital that is embodied in people, and natural capital. All that stuff out there, Mother Nature has given us. Forests, trees, ponds, lakes, ecosystems in general, and subsoil resources. It always makes sense to talk about the inclusive wealth of nations because that measures is a surrogate for social well-being. But unfortunately, the current crisis will deflect our attention away from long-run problems that humanity faces. The actions that need to be taken to, uh, to bring about the real growth of nations are those that enhance the inclusive wealth of nations. The point about the wealth measure is that it is the indicator whose movements track social well-being. Therefore, when one asks growth in what, we should be answering by saying growth in the wealth of a nation. Uh, adjusted, of course, for population demographic changes. But remember, the idea is not to maximize the growth of wealth. The idea should be to optimize the rate of change in wealth per capita, if you like.